Unit 8, Lesson 2, Economic Development Vocabulary Sustainable Sustainable Anonymity Anonymity Demand Demand Gauge Gauge Ensure Ensure Expansion Expansion Hydropower Dam Hydropower Dam Implementation Implementation Tourism Industry Tourism Industry Natural Resource Natural Resource Contribute Contribute Private Sector Private Sector Robust Robust Shift Shift Stable Stable Assist Assist Market Oriented Market Oriented Manufacturing Manufacturing What are Lao economic trends? It continues to grow gradually. What are the major forces to make the economic growth? They might be from natural resources or the tourism industry. Do hydropower dams contribute to Lao economic growth? Yes, very much. What is the Lao economic projection rate in 2010? I think it'll reach 7.7%. Wow, that sounds interesting. What is the rank of economic growth compared to other East Asian countries? It's the third fastest after Indonesia and China. Does the Lao economy have a clear future? Yes, it does. What are Japanese economic trends? It remains stable in recent years, but they have a very good future. Lao Economic Growth Projection Source, Vientiane Times, April 8, 2010 The implementation of the government policy shifting from a centrally planned economy to a market-oriented financial system in 1986, allowing the private sector to play a role in the development of the national economy. Lao economy continues to grow gradually. The World Bank released its East Asia and Pacific Economic Update for 2010, projecting Lao economic growth to reach 7.7% this year, the third fastest rate in East Asia after Indonesia and China. According to the World Bank, natural resources and tourism industry will remain the driving forces behind the economic growth in Laos. Hydropower dam and mining expansions are expected to contribute about 3.6% of total economic growth. According to the, w, the World Bank, Lao fiscal growth reached 6.7% in 2009, the second highest in East Asia after China. The bank said that strong growth was due to stable demand 
for Lao mining products in China. The World Bank urged the Lao government to focus on breaking into manufacturing and becoming part of global production chain to ensure sustainable economic growth in the future. Recently, the government is aiming to maintain the economic growth at 7.5% in the 2009-2010 fiscal years, after reaching 7.6% in the previous year. Stable economic growth will assist its efforts to move Laos from least developed nations group by 2020. ASEAN Economic Community Following the formal signing, the AEC will officially open on December 31, 2015. It forms one of three pillars of the ASEAN community, a broad framework of regional political security. The other two are the integration community, which aims to link up the region's foreign affairs and security interests, and the socio-cultural community, which seeks to build people-to-people -people connections. The AEC seeks to reduce barriers to trade, services, investment, and skilled labor across ASEAN with the aim of making the region more competitive economically. The recently signed declaration, and indeed the establishment of the AEC, will not mean that the region will begin to act as a completely harmonized economic bloc. Among many things, this would entail regulatory uniformity, integrated production standards, commonality on labor laws, and a general reduction of non-tariff trade barriers, of which many still exist in the region. This, however, is not the end game, as ASEAN was never meant to be an EU-like union.